one great resource that we have on campus, of course, is our campus trees. And we are a tree campus USA here at U of L uh, because of all the work we do to preserve, protect, enhance, and expand our awesome campus trees. And this is one fantastic example of a tree we're really proud of here at U of L. It's an apple tree that was grafted off of the tree that dropped the apple on Newton's head. Uh, and we've got it making fruit for us every year here at U of L. Delicious, great apples that are ready in August. Uh, when you come back in the fall uh, to start classes again, think about maybe harvesting some of the apples that'll be down on the ground. Uh, or maybe you can just pick them right off the tree. These branches are hanging nice and low. Another thing you can see at this time of year in May is the tree is an excellent resource for our local pollinator population. Uh, so we're very pro-pollinator here on campus. We do a lot uh, to sustain our native pollinator habitats because we know that a lot of the food on our plates is reliant on those pollinators. Uh, and in our urban environment, it's a tough place for bees uh, and other native pollinators. So we, we like to have flowering things all over campus, and this is a great season to look at them. Our Schumard oak here it's not only native to Kentucky, not only does it belong here, but you could say that it belongs here more than we do. It totally predates this campus. We believe this is the oldest tree on our campus, and it's an incredible, incredible species, a, a great piece of our green infrastructure. Uh, we really think of trees as just as important as the other infrastructure on campus, right? You think of sidewalks, roads, sewer lines. We can't live without those, but we also can't live without our trees. Why? First of all, they're producing oxygen. Really important, right? Couldn't live without it. Second of all, they're taking carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere and helping us tackle the greatest crisis facing humanity, which is global climate change. Third of all, they help with our stormwater issues. Trees and their deep roots help drag stormwater down into the groundwater where it belongs. But they also provide great habitat, shade, so we don't have to cool our buildings as much in the summer. A nice evergreen provides a windbreak so you don't have to heat a building in the winter quite as much. And of course the habitat for all that wildlife that we share this planet with.